Good morning! We're currently walking through town to go to a noodle demonstration. I don't know what you're doing in the background. <laughs> Um, but we're gonna go learn about all the different noodles they make here in Hoi An. And then we might go learn about making some of the famous lanterns that are here. Oh my here. god, it just dripped in my belly button! <laughs> Sarah's having issues. <laughs> um, but anyway, that's what we're doing. Say hi, Carol. Hi, Carol. Cute! <laughs> Just lanterns? There's no like, it's not like a paper lantern. So we learned how to make them and you have to like glue them down Sarah, and stitch and things. cut the fabric. Ah. Um, so I made this pink one which is currently in a bag so it looks like it's about to rain. And there's Carolyn over there waving. She made, a, she made a white one. And yeah, so now we all made one of these and it was an adventure. Um, I learned that I suck at using scissors but that's okay because my lantern turned out pretty cute. Um, and yeah, we'll see if it makes the journey home. I have low expectations, but I'm keeping an open mind. And now we're walking back to the hotel and we're going to go on a cycling tour of the city. But I don't know if the rain's gonna hold out. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. <laughs> got these bikes and we're literally just biking through these like long paths. See all the way down there. Here's the field. And if you see right there, we've got some water buffalo. But yeah. Don't worry mother, we're being safe. We have helmets. the traditional way to water some lemongrass. Yeah. So we just interacted with a water buffalo which are used to help with farming here so it's all all good. He's domesticated. They treat him very nicely. <laughs> <laughs> I always like hesitate when they're animals. Like, uh, but, like but want a picture with it. Yeah, like, but his owner was treated him very, very nicely. Um, so yeah, now it's starting to rain, so we're gonna make our way. I don't know where we're going. We might just keep biking in the rain, so we'll see. But I'm putting my camera away, so sorry, no videos. She's about to go fishing. And then no fit more than that. 
Wait, should I take this off? Uh, turn around, turn around. Oh, Answer the one. Uh, no. Zip <laughs> it up with your helmet. Your helmet. Oh, up. yeah. Yeah. Wow. Oh, my oh, God. Like the yeah, you didn't oh. take the whole chew, eh? This is where yeah. you put it. This is like my puppet. Okay. Turn around. Wait, wait, wait. Turn around. No. Yeah, I need oh, to take it. Oh, you're doing half? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I love my double fisting right it's now. It's weird because these like pants like suction to your skin now. Ew. And it's a weird sensation. Yeah, right on the side she like that. She got one. Oh. <laughs> Something poked me. Probably the fin. Get it. I'm gonna go with my left hand because I need this. <laughs> oh, I pulled it. <laughs> There's a fish in there. Oh, oh no, you're so watching. <laughs> no snails, fish! <laughs> Thin is really sharp! Sure. Yes! Ask the guy to help you. Oh, oh. oh you come on! Yes! Catch it! Catch it! I don't like the element of surprise! There are savage fish in Like this big. They're not very big though. Oh, I have teeth! Oh! Oh, 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 I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm not ready. Get it. Oh, I thought it again. I don't like it. She's so determined. She's so determined. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yes! Take it out! Yeah! Oh my god! Oh my god. Guys, I cheated! <laughs> we didn't see that you cheated, Jura. Okay? okay, good. It wasn't caught on camera. She got the fish. Look at it. Wait, one more, one more. Sarah got one. Yeah, I did. Yeah.
I didn't put them on properly though. Oh. You just shoved oh, them now I can hair. see. You look great. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we out here. And she's she's doing it. I'm stirring. She's she's stirring the pot. The pot that we call row, row, row your bamboo <laughs> boat gently down the street. Gentlemen, start your engines! because it was an exhausting day because as you already saw we went biking and out of a group of like 15 or 16 people everyone took a motorbike where you had to hang on to some other person but then we Lame. decided but then we <laughs> but then Kara and I decided we were going to bike this whole thing which was a 12 kilometer bike ride so worth it. Um, which is that even that far I don't even know what that is, we're wasting miles. We're American. So, anyway, we decided to just hop on these bikes willy-nilly for a 12 kilometer. Who knows? That could have been 100 miles. Okay, she's looking up right now. We'll get back, we'll get back to you. Um, but so, we hopped on these bikes, and then we were zooming through. We were not going fast at all, actually. <laughs> we were taking a leisurely... A nice stroll. We were taking a leisurely bike ride through all the giant rice paddy fields, and it was the most gorgeous, gorgeous. thing ever. Um, I think it was honestly one of the highlights of this entire, like, month-long adventure that I'm doing. Um. Really? Oh. So we were biking through the rice paddies. <laughs> and it was the most gorgeous thing ever. Um, I have more words, but they're not coming to me right now. But it was a really unbelievable experience. And so, the thing that was wild, though, is we thought we were just biking, but we hit up, like, five yeah, picture <laughs> stops. And just did, like, a whole crap ton of stuff. That was wild. So I think first we stopped and just like looked at the rice patties and then the second time we stopped For we were in the farm. Looking. No, we were in the farm. There's this really famous like super old couple who are in their 90s. So we saw them and said hi and they're just like Hoi An mascots apparently. Literally. They're literally on like postcards and everything. It's very weird. Um, so we talked to them. <laughs> it's a little strange. I'm sure they have some. They probably done something. I don't know. What, I don't know. We never got the story there. But then we biked from there to, was that the water buffalo? Sorry, yeah. I'm not showing Carolyn because she's all ready for bed and I would feel rude doing that. Oh, you could show me. <laughs> <laughs> she just smiled on her big potato <laughs> <laughs> smile. Mom, um, my mom, you mean? <laughs> Your biggest fan. Um, so let's just say from there we went to the water buffalo. And the water buffalo, you could ride the water buffalo and do some crazy things like we oh, were no, standing on it i did okay so maybe this might get cut out whatever um so we saw a water buffalo i patted his head and mm -hmm. then we kept going and then we went fishing like in local vietnamese style fishing and it was like a training camp yeah. yeah so it was like this little thing where it's normally where you train people to learn how to fish 
um, oh, traditionally. Boy, was Captain Croc trained. Oh, we definitely have video of that. So you already saw that. That was something else. I realized I don't like touching fish. I don't like it. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like it. Shocker. Um, so that was something crazy. I honestly just volunteered because no one else was really volunteering and then other people volunteered afterwards. So that was kind of a mistake on my end, but it was a good experience. I think. After that, we biked some more. I feel like we did some... Oh my gosh, I'm forgetting the whole boating experience. Yeah, that was... Oh, wild. man. Okay, so then we were going, and he's like, 30 minutes back to the to the town. And we're like, okay. No, 30 minutes to go to these roundabout Weeble Wobby boats, which I think are called bamboo roller boats. Something like that. Um, so we did those, and I definitely know we got footage of that. We had some snacks, and we took a really pretty picturesque boat ride back to the city. It was so relaxing. It was phenomenal, and the sun was setting while we were going on the boat. Except there wasn't really a sun anyway. Yeah, I didn't really know where the sun was, to be yeah, honest. Was it like was just dark all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, and at that point, we were famished, because we had just done a million things, and just biked to however many miles we it biked. Did, it never showed up, so. Yeah, we don't really have internet no, okay. right now. Yeah, so we got back, and then we got dinner, and I didn't really, I don't know, I feel like I always bring my camera and get, like, B-roll of dinner, but it's, like, I don't think it's very entertaining. At this point. It's entertaining for us to go to dinner, but I don't think it's very entertaining to watch people go eat more Vietnamese food. If it is, I apologize, because I don't think you're going to be getting that anymore. Um, and then we just <laughs> walked around the night market. And it started raining. I really wanted to take some night photos, but it was pouring, but so I was like, whatever. Really good ones. Thanks. Really successful. Yeah, I took some. I wanted to do some like long exposure ones, but we just didn't get that, and that's totally fine. You make do. Creativity is all about working within your parameters. I just what did I say? Parameters. 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 So I think clearly I'm delusional. It's weird because it's only like 10:30, but this is like when I normally eat dinner at home. But we wake up really early and just like. Snap to it, but tomorrow... Tomorrow's gonna be fun because we're gonna go shopping again. Yeah, so tomorrow we're gonna go shopping again and just kind of relax and see what there is to do. More so that we haven't done. That wasn't a sentence. Good night. Oh, wow. <laughs> Woo! Oh, he's so cute. Bye-bye.